cliff top. from? Uh, Nashville, Tennessee. Clarksville, but it's Nashville, close to Nashville. And how many years have you been coming to the festival? Three. Okay. And um, do you, what is the most important thing about the festival to you that you like the best? Getting together with the people and learning new songs. Mm -hmm. And you're a very accomplished fiddler. I heard you last night. That was great. Um, do you, um, what, what draws you to the old time style? Um, I think the rhythm, learning new songs, and it's easier to play. The bluegrass stuff is so much faster, and everybody just plays together. Uh, where, where are your ancestors from? I believe they're from Germany, so and I'm the, not sure what else, but Germany. We just say Germany. And they came uh, to uh, Minnesota, you had said. They, they, they came. Uh, Iowa, Iowa and Minnesota, as far as I know. Have you? What are some of the good things you learned this year so far? Any so tricks? Wear different clothes. Yeah, <laughs> differently for this weather. That's cute. Um, just being able to welcome new people because I knew that I sort of figured that you were new. So if you've been here before, I always ask, Have you been here before? Where are you from? Uh, I don't know. Last year they said there was about three thousand. That's a lot. And I don't know how many are here. This year. Right. So it's that's that's the fun part. And then
Um, where are you from? I'm from uh, Mount Airy, Maryland. And um, how many years have you been coming to the festival? I've been coming three years. I've been playing fiddle for three years. And when I first came here, I knew one song, Angela and the Baby. And um, what what draws you to um, the festival? Oh, it's just it's a wonderful spirit here. Um, everybody's really friendly. I love I love hearing this music in in such an organic setting. This is where this music came from. This is where it belongs. It's where it sounds best. And um, this is where people share it with each other. The, um, the all the old grandpas on the porch sharing the sharing um, the the tunes with the young people. It's great. Cool. And um, what uh, draws you to old time music in particular? Um, the simplicity of it. Mm -hmm. uh, it's very very simple tunes. However. Once you have the tune, you can really zhuzh it up with double stops and uh, drones and you know all kinds of embellishments and ornamentations. It doesn't have to be so simple. It's just beautiful. And it's fun. It's, it's fellowship music. It's meant to be played with other people. So you, you make friends and you meet people and you, what, you, what we have in common is the music. There's, there's so much tearing us apart today. It's so wonderful to have something that we have in common. I agree. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so, um, tell me, where are you from? I'm from originally Springfield, New Jersey, and uh, I've lived for the past number of years in Columbus, Ohio. Okay. And um, can you tell me, is that where your family is from, your ancestors? Sure. They're all Central European or Eastern European Jewish, essentially. And, um, yeah. You, how many years have you been coming to the festival? Uh, probably around seven or eight at this stage. Mm -hmm. This is all about a, a very, very different kind of cultural exchange and people learning from other people, intermediate musicians learning from master musicians and then people just getting started out learning from intermediate musicians and uh, it's a culture about sharing and not about exclusivity and kind of rigid hierarchies and stuff. <laughs>
I'm going to move. Over the yeah, and there's other people Keep the rhythm, keep the rhythm going, don't, and, and no one will kick you out. <laughs>